To create an assessment in LPI Online, begin by clicking the Create Assessments button. For this example, we'll create an assessment adding the leaders individually. Then press Next. Since this is a new account, there are no folders to display. Begin by clicking the Add New Folder button, entering the folder name and description that you wish to use. Save the folder and click the Select button to select the folder. Then press Next. On the Add Leader screen, you will have the choice to add leaders by name, by email, or by username. It is best to add leaders by email if this is their first time taking an assessment. To add a leader, enter their email address and press the Add button. If this is a new leader, you will have to enter their first and last name and a phone number if you wish. To continue, press the Next button. On this page, you'll be able to select the completion or due dates for both the leaders and the observers. Click the Calendar button to select the date. Once the date is selected, you may wish to press the checkbox to make the SLPI Student Guide available for the students. The students will see this once they sign into their accounts. Once you've chosen the completion dates, press the Next button. On this page, you will select the email delivery notification dates. This is when the emails will be sent to the leaders and the observers. As on the previous page, click on the calendar icon and choose the date you'd like the emails to be sent. You may also wish to add a custom message to your leader. Please note that as you enter your message, it will show you how many characters you have left. On the lower portion of the screen, you will see an example email that will be sent to the leader. It will also show where the custom message will go as well as the dedicated LPI online link that your leader will use to access the assessment. It will also include the date as well as a link to our customer support site. Once finished, press Next. On this last page, you will be able to confirm all of your choices and make any edits or changes if necessary. Once you've reviewed all of your choices, you may click Confirm, which will create the assessment. Once the assessment has been created, you will receive a congratulations message letting you know that the assessment has been created and the appropriate number of tokens have been removed from the account.